On my 11-day Caribbean cruise, I set out on a mission to feed a homeless dog or cat on each island we visited, but you'll never guess what a dog on Grand Turks Island did. Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel, Fantastic TV. Today's video is a bit different as I share my experience in Grand Turks during my recent 11-day cruise. As some of you may know, my mission during this trip was to visit and feed homeless dogs and cats in every island we stopped at. So as I was exploring the beach in Grand Turks, I came across a dog that seemed to be in really bad shape. It looked like he was on the brink of death, barely eating or drinking anything. Many people on the beach tried to help, offering food and water, but the dog just seemed too exhausted to even move. Despite everyone's effort, the dog just lay there, seemingly giving up. It was heartbreaking to see such a sweet animal in such dire condition. Feeling really bad for the puppy, I decided to name him Thomas. Luckily, while we were out there, a nice lady did end up bringing him some water, and surprisingly enough, he definitely did drink the water. It was really heartwarming to know that there are still good people in the world, and for sure, Thomas definitely did enjoy his drink of water. After about 45 minutes, eventually, all the people left the beach and returned to the boat. Surprisingly, Thomas suddenly got up and started walking around as if nothing had ever been wrong. In comes the twist. It was almost as if he was playing a trick on us, pretending to be sick to get some extra food and attention. Unfortunately, I did not have footage because we were boarding the boat and you have to put your cameras up. It was a truly surreal moment that made me realize just how smart and resourceful these homeless dogs can be. They know how to tug at our heartstrings and get what they need to survive. Leave a comment below. Do you think this dog was smart enough to trick the tourist into giving him free food and water? Whatever the case may be, I choose to believe in my heart that Thomas will be okay and he's just a really smart dog that has learned how to interact with tourists in his home turf. And hopefully one day, I'll see him again. If you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe. I visited four other islands with their own unique dogs and I can't wait to share with you all. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye.